That's a good one. Let it sink down. Oh boy. You're right on her. I'd go ahead and slow slide. Got her? Oh my gosh, Dave. Dude, you're an animal. You're an animal, dude. Let her go, that's a good one. Wow, dude, wow. Watch your line, buddy. Put your rod tip in the water because she's gonna come at you, try to stay tight. Come on. Keep that rod tip down, you got it. You got it, just like that. Come on, man. Which way is she coming? Come around to the room. Oh, man. Right beside us here, right beside us. Start casting, nine o'clock, keep going. Drop, a little right and drop. Good, let's sink, let's sink. Long, slow, slow. Barely move it, barely move it. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Got him, let him go. Hard, 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 hold him again. Okay, let him go. Good job, Art, good job, Art. Get ready to bow, get ready to bow. All right. Ah, he's off. You did everything right, man. <laughs> good try, that was all, it was all, all good efforts. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> they pulled up. Huh? Oh, they're just insane. They're such insane oh. fish. Open your wow, what a jump! That was the best thing <laughs> ever. <laughs> got him, got him, got him. <laughs> wow, that's a good fish, man. It's like crazy. One more! Get up. Give a couple hits. Got him. Good job. I wasn't even breathing. <laughs> You're breathing now? I'm, I'm breathing again. Anglers fish for tarpon all over the world using different methods for catching them. But the most effective way to ensure success in the Florida Keys is on a skiff in a tandem partnership. The front of the boat delivers the fly, but the back of the boat puts the caster in a position of success. They're coming at you, 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 you. It is a symbiotic relationship that the guide and angler share. 11.30, way out, 75, 80 feet, right there. Yeah, right there, him. you got him. Independent him. motions. Slow ship, slow. That Still are completely moving. dependent upon each other. Keep going. He's on it, got him. <laughs> pump, 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 got him. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about! Woo! How about that, huh? Woo! No one knows this better than Bo's guest today, Captain David Mangum from Santa Rosa, Florida. You're gonna grab the fish in the face. Yeah. Once you have control of them. David grew up in the panhandle and has held a fishing rod in his hand since he was a young boy. His passion turned into profession, and his endless pursuits for fish take him and his clients all over the southeast. Giant redfish lure him to Louisiana in the winter months. But come springtime, he has one thing on his mind, tarpon. They consume his thoughts and influence his emotions. He is completely obsessed with them. I don't know if it's healthy. It's, uh, <laughs> it just is who I am. I think throughout my life, anytime I've really gotten into something or really was interested in it, I was like all in. Every freaking thing about it, I just charge at it 100%. And Tarpon certainly has kind of grayed out everything else, <laughs> more so than anything else in my life that I've kind of pointed myself at. And it seems to be getting worse, you know. <laughs> um, I'm more, you know, enchanted by them now than I than ever have been. Bo asked David to come and chase Tarpon with him in the Keys. As you could expect, it didn't take much convincing. They are fishing out of the John Pennekamp State Park in Key Largo. Let's do this.
Captain Jared is also on the water today, fishing with his client and friend, Art Webb. I see him, hold on, I see him. Over here to your right, right up here, yep. Pick it up, right, and drop. Let's think. Long, slow strip. Longer, longer and faster. Keep going, slow. Here it comes, keep going. Real slow, keep going, keep going, keep going, slow, slow, go, pull, pull, go! Oh! Mm -hmm. Ate the heck out of it. Yeah, he did. Silver Kings is brought to you in part by Maverick Boats. Fish the legend. <laughs> by the Florida Keys and Key West. Come as you are. Yeti Coolers, built for the wild. And by Patagonia, fly fishing apparel and gear. They clean pretty snappy today. I mean, when you get the fly in front of them, they're snappy. They are snapping on it. Jared has been guiding Art for many years, but Art's love of fishing started in the north woods of Michigan, where he was a guide himself on the Pierre Marquette River for trout, steelhead, and salmon. Right beside you, right beside you. Start casting, nine o'clock, keep going. Drop, a little right drop. Good, let's sink, let's sink. Long, slow, slow. Barely move it, barely move it. Keep going. Keep going, keep going, go, let him go. Hard, 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 hook him again. Okay, let him go. Good job, Mark. Thank Good you, job, sir. Good job, Mark. Good job, Mark. Let us stick in there, brother. Let Thank you. Stick in. Okay, get ready for the bow. Don't do anything. All get right. ready, bow. Get ready, bow. All right. I just want to stay Good tight. Good job, dude. Thanks, man. Good job, man. You see how you hooked him right at him? Yeah. Dude, that's, you did money there. Money. Oh, man, I feel that head. Holy okay, get shit. ready. Good. Okay, he like him up jumping here. Get ready to bow. Ah, oh, he's off. You did everything right, man. <laughs> good try. That was all, it was all, all good efforts. Oh. Ah. <laughs> They're pulled, huh? Oh, they're just insane. They're such insane oh, fish. Man, I thought you had them good, too. Uh, I felt like I did. That's all right. Let's see what we got here. You know, you can kind of... Man, he ate that, he ate that little cricket. <laughs> <laughs> good job, dude. That was awesome. Thank you. It was awesome. Dude, it is a chamber of commerce morning out here. This is freaking as pretty as it's going to get. There's a really good spot on the outside edge over here. Oh boy. Ooh, oh, wow. another roller. They're getting happy now. Oh yeah. Look over here. Something yeah, that just pancake. Yep. Look at that. Wow. Dude, there is a population of large fish in here. They're gonna they're gonna lay up in here. Yeah, that was definitely an eat. Oh yeah. <laughs> that fish for Whoosh. Yeah, they're hitting their comfort zone. Look at the bubbles coming off of this. Wow, you saw the big bust out there? That's a big fish. And the thing is too, is that if they get up on that flat, it's only gonna another. be- Another. Another one? Okay, okay. This is- uh, God, it is beautiful. This is gonna happen right here. Oh, see it? Yep. Oh boy. Dude, having somebody like you, go ahead and bring that thing. Yes. Okay. Come on, show me something. <sighs> wow. I thought you did great. Man, I wanted that shot. That fish, I can see that her for a, a while. That was a big girl, buddy. Oh, yeah. Big one. That's a good one. Let it sink down. Oh, boy. You're right on her. I'd go ahead and slow slide. Got her? Oh, my gosh, Dave. Dude, you're an animal. You're an animal, dude. Let her go, that's a good one. Wow, dude, wow. Watch your line, buddy. Put your rod tip in the water because she's gonna come at you, try to stay tight. Keep that rod tip down, you got it. You got it, just like that. 
Where is she coming? Come around to the room. You saw that one bubble, right, when she like, dude, dude, I saw, awesome. I saw the bubble, and then I saw this. Woo! I saw the bubble, then I saw the fly, and I Don't, was like, no, you that didn't. That one will do it. No, you didn't. <laughs> and that one got her. Woo! Silver Kings is brought to you in part by Sea Deck Marine Products. Your boat deserves Sea Deck. By Deep Eddie Vodka. Dive in. Mercury Marine. Go boldly. And by Smith. The experience is everything. Yeah, we're about to get a wave over the bow right there. Woo! Yeah. Yep, I knew it. Ah! Okay, all right, you see him where this big clump of seaweed is? That big clump? He's yeah. right behind it, 10 feet. See his body? Yes. Art Webb has traveled to some exotic locations to throw fly lines at a variety of species. But he always comes back to the Keys where he spends a good portion of his time chasing the local tarpon, bonefish, and permit. Uh, I got a fish here at 10 o'clock. Start casting, there's a few fish here. Start casting, way right. Good, long shot. Let it sink. Barely move it. Inching it, slow. Barely move it. Barely moving it. Here it comes, keep going, keep going, got him. Hard, hold hard. Left. Oh, oh. Oh. That was a shot of all shots. I love that one. How far? Two o'clock. Right there. Yes. To the left side at an angle, okay? Up in front of him. Okay, talk to me. Facing away. Oh, boy. He's less sink. Slow. 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 Got it. Pull. Slow. Strip. 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 Let him go. He'll give him a couple jabs. Jab. Jab. Okay, let him go. He's going to clear the line. But don't let it bounce like that. Don't let it bounce like that. All right, Art. All right, man. The game has started. He's gonna come up jumping again, right when you pull. Quite a bit of drag. Fair amount. Yep, okay, then you're good. Here he goes. Yeah! A little bend to the rod, Art. A little bend. A little bend. How's Look that? that? Dude, how sick is this? That's killer. Okay, let's go. Let's get on the motor, too. Good job, man. Want me to come down to the cockpit or stay no, here? you're good right there, brother. You're good right there, brother. Okay. Good work. Okay, let's get up there. Let's get a leader touch on this bad boy. Nice fish, too. 90 yeah. pounder. Keep going, get that leader. Reel down. Got, Got it. that fish. Good job. Woo! Off. Nice, 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 nice. nice. That good was, fish. That was, that was fun. so cool. That thing can jump like three or four times. Redemption time. Let me see it, <laughs> my man. Woo! That's the way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Got some stink off. Mm. <laughs> Always a good time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's that? Three blind mice? Come on. Hoi, hoi, hoi. Silver Kings is brought to you in part by Maverick Boats, Fish the Legend, by Chica Lodge and Spa, the legend lives on, Clutch Fly Rods, dominate your water, and by Cortland Fly Lines, Tail Fly Fishing Magazine, and GorgeFlyShop.com. David, so when did you get into filmmaking? You know, just started taking pictures a long time ago. I mean, you're out in these places that are so beautiful, you just feel like you gotta, you know, you wanna take pictures of it and document it. And then started doing the same with fish, you know, taking pictures of cool stuff that fish do. And that kinda 
led into video and I don't know, just kind of off to the races from there and just, you know, it's one thing seeing a fish doing something cool and then catching them or whatnot and then the next step is trying to get a picture of that or showing that. It's, sometimes it's even harder and it's more fun for me to do that sometimes, you know, get it on video. Way harder than getting the shot with the rod sometimes. Yeah, and you have a unique opportunity to doing it every day. Exactly. Dedication to the sport of tarpon fishing means time on the water, which David commits to. Yeti released a highly acclaimed film in 2017 titled 120 Days. It is a direct reference to the number of days David spends pursuing tarpon with clients during their migration through the Gulf of Mexico. I think it would be honest to say I think about tarpon every day of the year at some point in my day like uh, yeah I live for the 120 days I fish for tarpon my my whole year structured around those days yeah I mean you know you, the second you see the fish and it's as big as you maybe bigger and you're doing this little piece of feather at it yeah I mean what there's not many games that get cooler than that the actual fishing part of it is, is neat and is the end result, but when you do it a lot, the catching of the fish is completely secondary. And for, for me as a guide, learning something new, that, that's different. That doesn't happen every day, and that's why that is so, that, that gets my blood pumping. These huge, giant-eyed fish are just kind of slowly coming at you, and and you can make contact. You know, reach out and talk to them. There's history to each and every one because they've they live so long. You know, uh, maybe that one's been to Nicaragua. And the one behind him, he stayed in the Florida Keys, and the one behind him, he went up to Chesapeake Bay last year. You know, each fish is an individual. Tarpon's been around about 100 million years. It hasn't changed. You know, they've found fossil record of the fish being just as it is now. And they are dinosaurs. They're dinosaurs with fins and tails. And I mean, if you're going to, out of all the fish in the ocean, if you're going to pick something to build your life around, I, I mean, I chose the tarpon and I think it was a good choice. all these white pelicans. I'll tell you what, dude, this is some beautiful, beautiful stuff today. Pretty day. Yeah. God, maybe it just needs to get deeper on them. I don't know. I mean, I've met a lot of people that enjoy tarpon fishing, but Dave is like a scientist. He's not just thinking about the fish and what they're going to eat and how he's going to strip or where he's going to sit or all that stuff. Too close, behind him. I'm good. He's got himself into a position where he's so submerged in the science of the fish, the water temperature, the migration, that, you know, he thinks like a fish, thinks like a tarpon. Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> I'm like, he's either really angry that he made a bad cast on this closed fish, or he sees something else. No, I saw something else. <laughs>
I'll tell you what, Dave. Woo! Is that when you got a guy that knows how to do it on the front, life is so much easier. How about that bite? Wow. <laughs> so good. So good. It's a nice fish, too. It is. Yep. Mm. That felt good. Feels so good. Mm. Oh, and there she goes. <laughs> oh. oh man, that was cool. Great job. We got a touch. <laughs> Boom. Oh, that felt good. That was cool. That was definitely cool. Got some great jumps out of that fish. Hey, cheers, everybody. Captain Ray, you guys ready?